We all have our friends, our acquaintances, and our best friends, but some of us are only lucky enough to have a gay best friend. We love to go shopping, talk all the time, be super creative. We also like to watch sports, hang out with the guys, build things, and cook. We are your typical everyday person, but Hollywood doesn't think so. In this critique, I will show you how television and films have created three stereotypes for gay men. Number one, the most important, is appearance and fashion. It is a man girdle. I got it in the man section at Victoria's Secret. Pretend you're a man for a second and tell me how hot I look. You look fine, but this is not working for me. I like the V, but it is doing nothing for my bus lot. Is that your natural hair color? Yeah. It's gorgeous. Thank you. See, this is the color I want. Someone get me to a day spa set. Great shoe. Don't ask. Number two. What our life is like through our eyes. Angel, do not. Today for you, tomorrow for me. Who is in the Broadway cast of the Pajama Game? Janice Page, uh, John Raitt, Eddie Foy Jr. I assume you mean the original cast because there was a revival in 1973 that starred Hal Linden and Barbara McNair. I am gay! He was... He, he was... He... He was singing a show tune. No! Not a show tune! Three hates the small gay! Kane, get that book Mama's been working on. You mean the Breeders' Informational Book of Living Examples? Yes, honey. Never put much heart in anything before. You strut into my life and help me go for something more. Now I stand up for myself. Now I stand up from the crowd. Now I'm standing on high heels and dead can see me now. And last but not least, number three, being over dramatic. Hey friends, lovers, mothers, and other strangers, you're never gonna believe what happened to me. Oh my god, did you see that? I almost did a half Nelson. I almost bruised my delicate, my delicate, my domo or I got just Mr. Tomatoes. Maybe it's just time for me to go home to Seattle. <laughs> You come into my house and you insult me and my boyfriend, who, by the way, is not that dramatic. And, oh God. One, Rachel's beautiful. Two, you're a bitch, and those are my products, okay? And maybe if you use them, you would have more oil than the Middle East on your face. Ooh. Okay. Stereotypes in our country are a huge problem, and the media is not helping it in any way. I cannot say some parts of these aren't true, but this is what was created as our stereotypical gay male, the best friend zone. You are 